Hello, my name is Ji Won An from Hanyang University in South Korea. The title of my presentation is Is the Impression Log Beneficial to Evaluation News Recommender Systems? No, it's not. In online news platforms such as Google News, news recommendation models are employed to recommend a few news articles to each user for better user experiences. They display a set of recommended articles on a user's personalized page in a platform, and she selects the news to click among them. We call this information impression log data. Previous studies employ the impression log data to evaluate the qualities of their trained models. The news that the user clicked is considered positive news, and all other news in the impression log data are considered negative news. In this paper, we name this testing setting an IMP-based test. However, we note that all negative news articles in the IMP-based test are those that were recommended to her in the past. That is, they are non-clicked news that had been predicted to be preferred by the news recommendation model. This paper claims that a user's test entries should include negative news articles of various degrees of her preferences to evaluate the models of various qualities accurately. To address the limitations of the IMP-based test, we propose a simple way of evaluating news recommendation models by employing a total of news articles, ignoring the impression log completely. In this way, negative articles of various degrees of her preferences will be included. We call this way of our model evaluation a total test and regard as an appropriate model evaluation approach. However, total test requires more time in testing than the IMP-based test since it should compute a larger number of articles. To address this limitation, we sample only K articles randomly among all the negative articles in the total test. We call this way of our model evaluation a RS-based test. These tables show the results of model rankings and evaluation times in three different test settings. These results confirm that the RS-based test can determine superiority among the models correctly as in the total test, while requiring the time as small as in the IMP-based test. This is the end of my presentation. Thank you for listening.